welcome back to my youtube channel so today's video is a vlog i just got axa and myself ready for the day and we're going to the center of marmaris we need to get a few things done for my turkey citizenship so axa is not in the best mood the last couple of days i'm not really sure why um he is just crying a lot and just, I don't know, not really himself. But yes, I'm going to apply for a Turkish citizenship, which is very exciting. I'm living in Turkey for more than eight years. So um, it's about time. And um, yeah, I'm gonna bring you guys along today. If you're excited for a new video, don't forget to give the video a thumbs up. So as you can see we arrived in the center, it's very very windy and busy um, So yeah, we're going to do first some stuff for my um, visa application With my life fast forward, never turn back again It's kind of funny that the more we pass time The more we need to set the rewind And our team was the year I had to leave you But now I'm seeing all the signs is this really happening? I can't believe it's true I'm just as surprised as you Is this really happening? I can't be too sure But one day I'll be yours again So it's the next day and yesterday I wanted to film more but honestly we were very busy with getting everything for my citizenship application so um, I thought I'd film a little bit today as well Axel just woke up from his first nap and it was a very short nap so I hope he has a longer nap later today um, but yeah I thought I'd tell you guys a little bit more about um, my turkey citizenship application and i also wanted to show you guys a little haul and the weather is absolutely awful today so as you can see i'm wearing this very cozy disney jumper today with mini on it so cute and um, because yeah it is quite cold and just not very nice today so i will tell you guys very yeah. quickly now um about my yeah. visa and my turkey citizenship application so i've been living in turkey for over eight years and my husband is turkey and this is very important because I know that lots of uh, visas get rejected like people who want to actually live here not for a holiday oh and to be very honest with you I don't really know about if you want to apply for a visa and you are not married to a Turkish person I'm not really sure what you actually need for that but I've been here on a family residence visa um, because like I said I am married to a Turkish man and um, I have to reapply every two years, which is a lot of work and a lot of money. And I believe that you can apply for a Turkish passport after four years, but I'm not entirely sure. And then I will have two nationalities. So I will have the Dutch nationality and the Turkish one. Um, in the Netherlands, they are also very strict with like a double nationality. But again, because I have a Turkish husband, you can have two nationalities. So uh, that's great because then I can vote here in Turkey and just lots of things are easier if you are Turkish. So um, yeah, I'm very excited about that. I know that um, I need to go to Mugla for an actual interview, uh, which is kind of nerve wracking because I'm not entirely sure what they're going to ask me, but I'm sure it will be fine. Um, everything will be in Turkish as well, which is like, I don't know. <laughs> I hope it's, 
I hope it will be fine. Yeah, if I have to go to Moog Lab for an interview, maybe I can vlog a bit as well. And yes, I will be making some lunch now for Axel. And then later I will show you guys a little haul. So I'm in Axel's room right now. Uh, my husband is with Axel right now. And I thought I'd show you guys a little haul with summer clothing for Axel. So Axel had a checkup and he is quite a big boy. He's like almost 15 kilos, which is quite big and he's also quite tall. So he is in a size 92, 98 right now. So the first thing is this green t-shirt. Uh, green looks really nice with him, I think. So um, this will be very cute like on a jeans. And then I also got this jeans uh, short and this might be a bit big on him still. But um, yeah, I will have a look. So that will be very cute together as well. And then he also got these shorts and this is like a very like comfortable fabric. So this is great for like around the house and when he plays outside. And then I've got three t-shirts from the H&M and I really love these. So these ones with like tigers and a panzer. So cute. And I don't mind if it's a bit oversized. Like this is in size um, 2 to 3 years old. So this might be a bit big on him still. But I think that looks also very cute. And then this green one. And again I love green with Axel. But this is more of like olive green. And then this one with another tiger on it. And these will look very cute again with like a denim short. And then I've got a few more t-shirts. So the first one is this blue one with some neon on the sides. And bright colors look great with him. Um, I had lots of clothing in like these beige uh, tones. And honestly it washes Axel out completely. He really looks great in more vibrant colors. And then I've got this green one with all little like palm trees and everything. And then this one with a tiger again. A lot of a uh, tiger team going on. So yeah, little hole. And um, like I said, I don't mind if things are a bit oversized. Like I also bought some uh, clothing already for next winter. And I'm glad that I chose a size like 104, which is like four years old. But I'm sure he will fit in that um, this winter. So yeah, a little summer haul for Axel. So I want to show you guys this very pretty nail polish combination. I shared uh, this color with you in another vlog, I believe. This is the pastel. Um, nail polish in the color 54 a very pretty pale pink um, but on top of that I use this essence one and this has like a very chunky glitter in it and as you can see it looks so pretty I did my nails about five days ago and really this stays on for about a week perfectly so if you want your nail polish to last a very long time use a chunky glitter like this one and this is the color let me see and this is called a star is born and yeah i absolutely love this so i'm in the bedroom right now and i just organized my husband's closet so i put all of his t-shirts right here and um, this smells so amazing like cinnamon i put that right here and then all of his uh, sweaters um, over here and his jeans and sweatpants and everything there so yeah, everything is nice and organized. Um, the sweaters he can still wear right now because like I told you guys, it's storming outside. So um, if it's getting really warm, maybe I will put them away. But yeah, for now it's okay like this. <laughs> so it is nine o'clock and Axel is sleeping. And I'm also going to have an early night um, because Axel woke up again very early around six o'clock. So, um, yeah, I really hope you guys enjoyed this little vlog. If you enjoyed it, please don't forget to give it a huge thumbs up. And don't forget to subscribe. And I hope to see you guys very soon in one of my other videos. Bye!